three bucks. Yeah, I'm I'm not making it rich. Whew. Morning, Kaizen. Morning. Morning, Scylla. I had something to say to you, so I'm trying to remember what it was. I think you're the one who recommended like an idle clicker game to me. You, you successfully killed like half a day for me. I forget what it was called. It had like the word card in the name. It was like card art or something. Cardook. Cookard. That was it. I played that and it was cute. But man. It took a little too much of my brain. It, like six hours just disappe disappeared. Glad I liked it. I want those six hours back. Like it... It was cute and fun, but I'm like, oh man, I had so much stuff to do. I was, I feel like I was mugged. Like here I am just like, unexpecting, like, like oh, a free to play game with cards and cooking. That'll be fun. And then BAM! All my time gone. Hey, now we're making money. Now we can get dice. I don't have nearly enough D20s in my life. Like, it's always fun to carry, like, a D20 with you. And whenever you can't make a decision, just, like, roll the dice. Take it like a D&D a &D roll. Just Baldur's Gate your way through everything. Be like, uh, let's see. Should I attempt to cook something complicated for dinner? Oh, we're out of deodorant. Can't have that. Hang on, sir. Never gonna be caught without deodorant. Not on my watch. Ah, uh, eight dollars. Got not quite enough room here. A little more thanks to you. I can get card box. I can eventually get one of these. Could use some more deodorant. And let's just assume I'm gonna need more of these too. I mean, I can afford all of that right now. Oh my god. Stop it. Sir, this is a Wendy's. We got certain standards and practices here. Did I ever check out the Good Heavens demo? No. Good Heavens, what was that about? I watched somebody play through, uh, thank goodness you're here. That was pretty great. Good heavens. I'm trying to remember what that was about. It's just not quite ringing the bell, you know? Whoop. 
It's like don't starve and cult of the lamb. Oh. I haven't looked at that at all. How did that one get by me? Seems like the sort of thing I'd be into. Had a good time with Don't Starve Together. Like, there's a lot of depth to that. Like, if your Valheim survival game group is looking for something to play, that's a fun one. I like the art style. I tried copying it and drew a little picture of, like, the girl with uh, the ghost sister for, for my daughter. She loved it. Whoop. Sort by price. It was fun because, like, it's an art style that I can kind of do. There we go. These are going to be my packs. We're going to build ourselves a deck. Come on, we just need something worth money. I need like the life-changing card. These gold guys are good. They're like worth five bucks a piece. <gasps> there we go. That's some life-changing money, $72. We're paying rent with this one. Some gold. <laughs> this poor guy at the counter, I'm like, you know what? I'll be with you in a minute. Hang on. Just gotta get like these rares, right? Like, I could never get into card games in real life ever again. Because, like, I like opening booster packs. Like, I like it more than anything. But there's so many people out there who do, like, real shady things. Like, way card pack it packs. Like, I think they just straight up, like, x-ray cards now. One dollar? Get out of here. I want to see you again. 72. Like, so if I ever bought, like, a booster pack, I'd always I'd be afraid that it was already scanned and, like, all the good ones had been picked up. It would bug the crap out of me. Alright, we need more shelves and I think more dice. Dice are a good purchase. Plushies. I could just make five hundred dollars. Oh, it's closing time. Okay. Boop. Bye, everybody. See you tomorrow. Hey, I made $45 in profit. While we wait for the people to show up. Let's see, what games am I excited for? Nightingale just had a really big update. Theoretically, that's pretty decent. Ooh, another full art. This one's like 50 bucks. Uh, let's see. Rekka. I kind of want to play Rekka. Come to think of it, I need a game to play for Thursday, and I'm wondering if I should play a new game. Or if some other game it does really well on YouTube, I might play it again. Like Chef RPG, I'm pretty interested in. But there's so many good games to play. I need to know like what 
what the people want to help me decide. Because I'm down for just about anything. This game right here, I think I might actually play offline a bunch and then come back when my store is huge. So you don't have to watch this whole tedious, like, early stage stuff. Uh, $61. You broke my brain there for a second. Hundred and eleven. Is that the new record? That might be the new record. Thank you, ma'am. Alright, we can buy another shelf. We'll just keep expanding the store. What you got? Is that an expensive one? One dollar. For a foil card, that's a steal. Hang on. Let me grab... Oh, did somebody buy my other full art? Someone bought my good one. I didn't even notice. It's probably the lady who spent a hundred dollars. Nah, wouldn't have been him. Her. What is going on here? Hundred and twenty-three. That's a new record. Look, you better head straight for the door or I'm spraying you down, sir. Can't come in here smelling like that. Oh my god. You're not going for the door. Get out of here! Shoo! Shoo! So many... So many nerds just... I don't know, don't know how to wipe? I don't understand it. I really don't. I used to play a lot of Dance Dance Revolution and it always boggled me how some people smelled. Speaking of which... No! Like, I've only got so much patience for this sort of thing, you know? Also, I'm always uh, just a little bit paranoid that I smell terrible myself. I'm gonna move... Man, I wish it was easier to move stock. I wanna put like the yellow decks here. Or maybe I'll put them where the, these blanks... My hand is full with a single card sleeve. Don't believe it. Okay. Alright, let's buy more dice. We'll get all the colors in here. We're now a dice shop. That's a $29, or sorry, a $21 sun floor. You can have it, sir. 
I was gonna criticize you for coming in and buying a single card, but like 21 bucks, I'll take it. No stinking customers for Sugarheart. That's right. They also added from the demo this auto scent thing. I don't even know how this works. I imagine I put a deodorant in there and it just kind of blasts people as they come in. I'm excited to try that out, but I need like a to sell like a thousand dollar card first. Ooh. I just don't have my big ticket items. Move you over here. Here is your single card. Just wanted to break a ten. And here is your single card. You know, it's things like that that make me regret even getting that. Task successfully complete. 99 checkouts. Hang on, is there anything in there? Yeah. Oh, I saw that stinky guy. He's coming right in here. You better make a beeline for the deodorant. No, he sat down. Didn't even buy anything yet. He's just like, I'm gonna set up camp here. Not on my watch. Yeah, here. A single card. Starting to regret setting up the single card thing. And change my event. <gasps> yes. $50 a day, $8 an hour. Is that $50 a day per table? All right, we're going to hold off on that one. Whoops. My card prices would go up. That's a single card, but it's $49. I almost forgive him for coming in stinky. Almost. Okay, I can afford another license. Let's get the the next pack. No, we'll hold off till shop level eight still. And I get the plushies. I think the plushies are worth a lot of money. I really want to get into the action figure business. Seems like the way to go. We can buy some deck boxes. I'm interested in that too. I just need the variety. Oh. Dice. A 
Please give me $100. Actually, probably more like $800, because I actually need to buy the item, too. Dude's backing me into a corner. Wow, so cheap. You with your single card. Five dollars. And I saw you out of the corner of my eye. Get out of here. Hey, we're all smelling great now. A lot of collateral damage on that one. here I just can't it placement never feels quite right you need more of those and what are you doing buying a million card sleeves all right that's money that's real money Is that an expensive one? Kind of looked like it. Three bucks. Uh, take it. All right, uh, we can get a deck box. Still got lots of deodorant. It's nine o'clock, time to close. <laughs> Only two dissatisfied customers? That's pretty good. Six. I think I need to start paying rent soon. Yeah. Oh, they took rent down a lot. I think. It's not based on like shop level or something. Because I could have swore when I played it by myself, the rent was like $600. And I'm like, I'm making like 50 bucks a day. I don't have like the the blue eyes sun flork. Kaiba came Kaiba came in and tore it up. That's a Yu-Gi-Oh joke. You're gonna hear a lot of those. How many of those did you get? Get yourself some deodorant, maybe some dice. Couple individual cards. I don't mean to fo follow you around, but. Yeah. That's an acceptable, respectable purchase amount. 60 bucks. Thank you.
I need like 500 though. Wow, time flew with this game. I gotta, get, I gotta get the kids to school in like half an hour. I feel like I just started. Alright. You want any cards for these sleeves? Not on my watch. Got you. Should I get another card table? Feel bad when people are standing around. To open some more packs. We're down to the two dollar cards. Sir, I cannot see. This guy I like. This guy I like. Well, maybe. Did he use up all my deodorant? He left me one. Thank you there. Okay, what have I got? Uh, I'm gonna need more... More blank cards. Or, sorry. Card sleeves. I'm gonna need some more deodorant. Extra of these. I'll just drop them down here. I'll use this shelf for like my overflow. Speaking of which, 